Hi kids, uh, how are you all doing? And I hope you're having some fun every day. So I thought we could do a quick race game using Scratch Junior and this will also help introduce the uh, app to you. And uh, this is something that you can really get your hands on and experiment and play with. So let's quickly get into it. So this is your Scratch Junior application and you are inside the home screen. Now, what you have to do is, you know, first just click on this plus and this will immediately create a project for us. Now, what we are going to do is choose uh, two or three sprites that will help us uh, create this race game. So let's go for a zebra. Then again, click on the plus sign to choose one more sprite and let's go for a frog. And let's have one more and maybe a dog. So like you can see, we have all three sprites out here placed well. So now what we'll do is this is very plain. So I'm going to give it a background. So we'll come here and maybe choose uh, a seven. -er. This is a good background that they have. And you know, this can be a good background for a race game. So let's quickly come to our dog. And uh, maybe I want, you know, my uh, dog to win. So I can actually click on this grid here and this will show me my X and Y coordinates and also uh, the numbers. So what I want to do is first to trigger this event, I will come here to my event trigger uh, buttons and choose the flag. What this means is when I click on this, the race will begin. Now I want my dog to move forward. So I'll come here, choose the uh, forward button and I want my dog to take maybe 20 steps. And I also want it to be able to go at very good speed so I'll go to this turbo man choose the fastest and then I'll also come here to record a cheering voice how wow I win now we put that here and then we we'll land this race for the dog now uh, we need to do the same code for the frog and the zebra instead of doing it from the scratch. All we have to do is drag and drop it here and drag and drop it here. Now come to the frog. There you go. You will see it. Now I don't want it to go at 20. Then it will start matching my dog. So maybe we want it to go at 15. And we'll give it a medium speed. And we can leave the pop as it is. Now let's come to the zebra and we want it to go at 10. And uh, instead of a pop, we can give it a text. So you see, if I have to remove a button, all I had to do was, you know, drag and drop it on the top. So I want my zebra to say, Here. So there you go. Now let's see how this works. All I have to do is click on the flag. So you can see that uh, the steps are a little too much. We don't have as many. We can't keep a 20 because the maximum is 15. So I'm going to change the steps. I think I will change this uh, to seven. I'll go to my dog and I'll change that to 15. Go to my frog and I'll change that to 10. That should work. There you go. Now this is wonderful. I'll take the grids away so it can look neat. So I hope you enjoyed this. Uh, there's a lot more that you can do with uh, Scratch Junior. Uh, so please install it and start playing with it. 
Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.